Hello class of 2019, welcome to the art department. We believe everyone can create and everyone can learn. Think you can't make art? Take an art class and let us teach you. We live in a visual world and no matter your career path, visual literacy skills will help you on your way. Let's take a few moments to look at the opportunities in the art department for the class of 2019. It is important to refer to the flow chart in the course booklet as you are making your decisions, especially for second semester, as there are many more options after you've taken our Art Foundations class. Several others I will highlight now. Let's start with Art Foundations. You'll explore drawing, painting, clay, and sculpture. We'll teach you to see, to trust your eye, and to coordinate your eye and hand. This class is a prerequisite for most other art classes. So second semester, you'll be eligible to enroll in another art class that is connected to the circle representing art foundations. Other art classes freshmen can take first semester are web page graphic design or yearbook one. Web page graphic design is an important graphic design course for beginners. It's for anyone who wishes to create an attractive functional web presence. In yearbook, where you will learn real life skills, graphic design, Adobe software applications, and represent your friends, clubs, and sports in the yearbook. Now, let's take a look at second semester registration options. Second semester, you will be able to enroll in photography, art 2D, art 3D, and art and design. Art explorations, intro to Photoshop, intro to animation, or yearbook two. As you can see, many of these courses lead to other opportunities in the art department, accumulating in capstone classes that support your advanced skills and portfolio needs. We are developing creative thinkers and skills that apply to all disciplines, improve your ability to communicate visually, to create with your hands, and to understand the artworks and objects around you in relation to the larger world. Plus, art is super fun, so take art classes. See you in the fall. Hi, I'm Sherry Hillenbrandt, instructional leader for the CTE departments. What's CTE? It stands for Career and Technical Education. In CTE, students are provided the opportunities to utilize what they've learned in their math, science, English, and social studies courses and apply them to the real world to get them college and career ready. Before you realize it, four years is going to fly by, and if you're a senior, you're realizing this firsthand. Robbie, hey, congratulations, you graduated. You. What are you doing next year? Going to college. What are you going to major in? No idea, but I'll be majoring in something. Hey, good luck. Yeah. Congratulations. Most likely, the path will continue by enrolling in college. I'm sure you're all aware of the expenses of college. Oftentimes, students enroll with no idea of what they want to major in or what their career path is. Over 50% of students will change their majors several times, and that costs you money. So what does this have to do with CTE? That's easy. CTE courses help them discover their passions, who they are, and what they want to become before it costs you an arm and a leg. CTE classes are designed with teachers working with professionals in the community to design the most relevant, up-to-date curriculum. Guest speakers, job shadowing, and community service learning projects allow students a taste of the real world. The best way to understand CTE is to see it in action. Hi, I'm Mr. Bain, and welcome to Information Technology. Information Technology is a hands-on process. Filming videos, designing brochures, creating websites are just some of the topics that we learn in class. Let's take a look at what some of the students are creating in class. Lucas, what are you creating in class? I'm using Adobe Premiere to make a PSA uh, that will be shown on Fox 47 News Channel. Ben, what are you working on? Oh, I'm using Adobe Dreamweaver to create a cool website and I'm using Photoshop images. Hey Emily, what are you working on? I'm making a weather report that I made using the green screen. Let's take a look at what some of the students are working on in the studio. Students, what are you working on? We're producing a commercial that is selling a marketing product. As you can see, students are using professional equipment and software to design media that can be used in a 21st century learning environment. Welcome to the metals, powers, and woodworking labs. Here you can start exploring a variety of real world practical skills that will help you decide if one of these fields could 
become your career. From cabinets to welding or small engines, if you love working with your hands and making small projects, these classes are for you. Start your personal exploration today. The top college majors are in the business or marketing fields, so get ahead by taking several business classes at Middleton High School. We believe in learning by doing. You'll work with local businesses to learn firsthand the foundation of how the financial world works. Accounting, business administration, law, finance, and most importantly, personal finance. You're all gonna be making money someday. So take personal finance to fulfill your financial literacy requirement. It's the most popular class to complete the requirement. Hey, you want to make lots of this. The marketing classes at MHS provide hands-on learning. Are you creative? One project involves creating an advertising campaign for a local business. Getting involved with DECA is another way for you to experience the exciting world of marketing. DECA members take field trips to learn how businesses market their goods and services and attend competitions that focus on different marketing principles. There are many opportunities to travel and meet people from all over the U.S. Are you looking for a class that's relevant for your future? A class to help you win your life skills for career exploration? A class where you can see how your learning connects to your life? A way to meet service learning requirements in class? Then look no further than Family Consumer Sciences. We have what you need. Interested in learning more about children or careers related to children? We offer fun, relevant classes with a student-run preschool. Service learning opportunities available. You can also earn your state certification for assistant child care teacher and infant toddler. Um, and you get to work with children in the classroom. Interested in a career in banking? Interested in running your own business? Or maybe just learning your way around the kitchen and creating a meal? Global Foods, Introduction to Culinary Arts, and Cardinal Cafe is the place for you. Have fun while eating your lessons. Does House Hunters, Property Brothers, love it or list it? Flip or flop? catch your attention, interior design classes are the place for you to start to learn the foundations of designing and decorating. Are you interested in going into the medical field? Introduction to medical occupations will help you explore careers in the medical field. Medical terminology and certified nursing assistant is a prerequisite for most medical majors. Earn these credits while here at MHS. Do you shop too much or worry how you'll buy those must-have items? Do you need help learning how to budget for life in college or after high school? Then Consumer Finance is the course for you. This course fulfills the graduation requirement for financial literacy. Serve, Lead, and Learn is a unique course that introduces you to service opportunities and setting up a service learning project in class. Community service can be that gateway to give you an advantage over others for college, scholarships, or jobs. This class definitely meets the service learning requirement. Last but not least, introducing one of our newest members of our course descriptions is the food science course. Are you interested in becoming a food detective? Have you ever made a product that didn't turn out and you wondered what happened? Take food science, where every kitchen is a chemistry lab investigating foods. This course meets the requirement for half science or career technical education credit. There is something for everyone in the family consumer sciences area. Explore a career potential or a class to add to your total learning package. I've always wanted to find out how things work or maybe how everyday products are designed. Or are you interested in designing new products? Then engineering could be the right fit for you. The engineering graphics classes in career and technology education focus on engineering and architectural design and use state-of-the-art software to help students reach their goals. These classes prepare students for high-demand careers in engineering, architecture, manufacturing, construction, and graphic arts. If you want a more in-depth study of engineering, then our Project Lead the Way Pathways to Engineering program could be what you're looking for. PLTW is a nationwide engineering program that uses hands-on activities and problem solving to prepare students for future careers in science, technology, and engineering. Milton High School currently offers two foundation courses that give students an introduction into both the design side as well as the math and science behind engineering. We also offer specialized courses in civil engineering and architecture, digital electronics, and software engineering, as well as a capstone course where students get the entire year to design, produce, and test a solution to a real-world problem. 
It is important to note that college credit is available for all six Project Lead Way Pathways to Engineering courses offered. We understand how overwhelming it can be to complete course requests. There are many required courses and few slots, but I suggest taking the time to explore interest through CTE classes. Every year, make it a priority to enroll in at least one CTE course per semester. It will open many doors, helping discover who you are and who you want to become. Help discover your passion through CTE. I am Brad Schneider, the instructional leader for the music department. The performing ensembles available for ninth graders, band, choir, and orchestra, are all called Cardinal Band, Cardinal Chorale, and Cardinal Orchestra. These are the groups that the incoming ninth graders should be electing for their music uh, performance groups. In addition, there are several general music courses that are available to ninth graders. History of Popular Music, which is a survey course discussing rock and roll and swing era music of the 20th century. And then Garage Band, which is a hands-on rock technique course that is only available to those students with no background in music. Are you an actor? Have you always wanted to be an actor? Or do you just love drama? If so, then register for the semester long. Either one! Earn a fine arts credit while learning to perform and develop your acting and public speaking skills. Have fun with improv, voice and movement, developing characters, and writing and performing scenes. In the words of former Theater One students, You get to be yourself! And someone else. Don't be afraid to let it loose. In drama, being weird is not being stupid, it's being brilliant. And after you've finished Theater One, and you've decided you love theater and want to continue exploring this art form, you can sign up for Advanced Theater. In Advanced Theater, we continue to build on acting skills, get more in-depth with characters, and work on directing. So, come play with drama and join Theater One in Advanced Theater. Learn about performance, experience it for yourself. Yeah! Guten Tag! Buenos, Buenos dias. dias! Ni hao! Bonjour! Hey, have you guys thought about a language course for next year? Yes, I'm so excited. I'm taking Mandarin 4. Wunderbar. We offer Mandarin 4. That's awesome. I'm taking German 6. I'm glad that I can take it here at MHS, and I still can fit it in with all my other classes. Why should I bother? I've already got the credits I need to graduate. I found out that I could get college credit for the work levels 5 and 6, so I'm taking French 6 too. That's a good reason, but why do I really need to learn another language? It helps me see issues from a different perspective, and I get to make connections with people from other countries. I've heard that it can help you improve your test scores in other classes, get into college, and even get a job. That's true. My friend just beat out another person for a job because he can speak another language. And don't forget, there are opportunities for international trips and student exchange programs. Yup, French students come to MHS every year. Yes, I went to Berlin last summer through the German exchange program. I wonder when they'll offer a trip to China. Okay, you guys are right. I must have been un poco loco. I'm going to talk to my counselor right now because I don't want to be left out. Yang bao wei lai. What does that mean? Embrace the future. I had heard of a magical place where learning flowed freely, a place where reading, writing, speaking, and learning happened all day long, a place of great happiness where mystical things transpired. These festivities were run by a mysterious man, a man who went by the name Gatsby. Having moved in next to Gatsby in the English department, I decided to investigate one of his parties. When I arrived, People were creating a ruckus, reading, writing, discussing great works of literature. After wading through a rather poignant discussion on the symbolism in To Kill a Mockingbird, I found him, Gatsby. Hello there, old sport. Gatsby? None other. What can I do for you? I, I'm not, I'm not sure. I'm, I'm new to this whole thing. What whole thing, old sport? High school? Reading, writing, discussing literature? Exactly. I don't even know where to go in this party. Ah, uh, you must be a freshman. 
Well, we have some help for you, old sport. Yes, indeed. Oh, that's so great to hear. There are really only two different rooms at this party for a man like you, an English man, that is. Either the English Foundations room, or on the second floor, or the Honors English room on the first. Well, how should I know which room I'm gonna party in? Oh, great question, old sport. The truth is, we'll recommend one of the rooms for you based on your history. Hmm, oh, that's great. What if I decide I want to attend a different room than your recommendation? Oh, rather spunk, aren't ya? In that case, you can sign a waiver and go to the room that you wish. Wow, thanks, Gatsby. What is my recommendation? No, for your old sport, it's English Foundations. All right, great. I can't wait. Thanks for your help. Hello, class of 2019. Can you believe that you're almost in high school? Well, the math department is excited to meet you and help you through your educational journey. If you are taking CC3 currently, then you should be moving on to Algebra 1 for next year. There is also an Honors Algebra 1 course that is available, but there are specific criteria that are looked at to place students in this course. Standardized test scores and teacher recommendations are among the criteria. If you are currently taking Algebra 1 and have been successful, then you should move on to Geometry for next year. If you have not been successful in Algebra 1, you may want to consider retaking Algebra 1 next year. Algebra 1 skills are used at every level, so having a strong foundation is very important for further success. There is also an Honors Integrated Geometry Algebra 2 Pre-Calculus course that is available, but there are again specific criteria that are looked at to place students in this course. Standardized test scores and teacher recommendations are among the criteria. Your current math teacher would be a great person to talk to if you are unsure about what course you should take next year. That's a magic number. Hello, class of 2019. Welcome to Middleton High School. The Physical Education and Health Department is looking forward to meeting you and assisting you with your educational journey. During your freshman year, you will take Foundations of Health and Movement. This is a year-long course designed to provide you with a half credit for physical education and a half credit to fulfill your health education graduation requirement. Students will have the opportunity to enhance their individual levels of fitness and explore team and individual units, as well as functional and aquatic movements. Foundations of Health and Movement is designed to develop and utilize goals for personal well-being and also apply knowledge-based skills toward developing a lifelong interest in physical movement and wellness. After your freshman year, you'll have many more diverse and exciting Cardinal Corps courses you can choose from. The Science Department strongly recommends that all students complete at least the core science sequence of biology, chemistry, and physics. Having a well-rounded experience in science gives students opportunities to develop their ability to solve problems, design experiments, and investigate. These are more than just skills, but a perspective that allows students to approach the unknown with a sense of curiosity and discovery. Almost all freshmen take biology, which offers an earned honors credit that is open to all students. The earned honors option will be discussed in class during the first month of school. What's up class of 2019? My name is Mr. Hartman and I'm here to welcome you on behalf of the Social Studies Department at Middleton High School and provide you with an introduction to your Modern World History course that you will all be taking next year. Now, you might be asking yourself, why should I care about anything that existed before Twitter anyway? The answer, hashtag learn from mistakes. Don't be like the Cubs, learn from your mistakes. Make adjustments and you too can be the champion in your own game of life. Modern World History is a year-long course that will introduce you to world history from the Renaissance to the Cold War. In addition to demonstrating conceptual knowledge of the world history, this course focuses on improving the following skills. Verbal and written communication, critical thinking, interpreting a variety of data, and building a sense of global citizenship. You will demonstrate your mastery of these skills through assessments that more authentically illustrate your learning. You will have the opportunity to participate in Socratic seminars, mock trials, and design visual metaphors. Not to mention, you will come to understand that fact is truly more bizarre than fiction by learning about all these fascinating components of human history. The Black Death, the Renaissance, Da Vinci, the real housewives of King Henry VIII, imperialism, heliocentric theory, burning at the stake, the scientific method, revolution, 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 and more revolution. Why tennis courts used to be so cool, the guillotine, how this dude's name got on this. Industrialism, child labor, the steam engine, slavery, the assembly line, nationalism, 
World War I, trench warfare, propaganda, did I say nationalism? World War II, SARS, the proletariat, communism, capitalism, the great purge, the cold war, people with mustaches, people with beards, and a whole massive amount more.